What's up guys, it's your boy Darskin, and today we're going to be talking about how to play Saki Fua early on Global. Now, if you guys didn't know, there's actually a mission that allows you to play with Saki Fua on Global. But, so, to do this, what you want to do is, you want to go to the Vera Tower of Fantasy, and once you're here, you want to come to this left side, and then you want to talk to she Shelly, the doctor. Now, obviously, she's not here for me because I've already done it. So you'll talk to her and then she's going to have you go to like the Oasis Club and then after that you're going to go to like another area and then after you go to those, you do those things, it's going to teleport you to where you need to be to get the Saki Fua weapons. Now keep in mind, you have to have already fixed Mia. As you can see, I have Mia beside me. Once you fix Mia up, they allow you to, you, you know, have her as your following partner or whatever you want to call it. But yeah, after you fix Mia, you're able to do this quest. So if you haven't did the Vera story, you may not be able to do it yet. This area up here is going to be the area where you get to use Saki Fua's weapons. But I do want to warn you, if you fall off, it is decently... It's not super hard to get up here, but it's it's decently hard to get back up here. How I do it is I go over here to the airport, and I jump off, fly, and then I grab this wall right here. So if you do fall off, you may need to get back up here to continue. But anyways, what you do is you come over here, and once you come over here, whatever weapon you want it to switch out with, make sure you have it. So instead of me being on Freak's weapon, I'm on Meryl's weapon because Meryl's going to be the one I'm kicking out. For Saki Fua. Now, as you can see, I have Saki Fua's weapons in my team, right? I have Frigg's weapon right here, and then you can go to Saki Fua and do whatever you want to do, right? Now, keep in mind, it does not show it in the weapons here, right? As far as the weapons, it doesn't show it in the team. So, because of that, you cannot switch her stance. If you guys didn't know, she had an offensive stance whenever you had attack resonance or healer resonance, and then she had a defensive stance when you had the uh, tank resonance so but as far as right now you can't do that now as you guys can see you do have her full combo set and everything like that and you also have her discharge here let me go ahead and do this so you guys can see if you guys want to see your discharge here it is now she does not have an animation for the discharge yet I uh, turned the animations on and it didn't give it to give it to me so she doesn't have it yet but they'll probably put it in the game once they put her in the game also the thing about this is you can I don't know what happens after you kill these robots and that's because I keep walking away and it keeps resetting it so let's say you guys want to keep using Saki uh, you can all you got to do is walk away come back and then it'll reset it anyways that is how you you know use Saki Fua early uh, like I said, I don't know what's after this mission. So if you guys do call the robots and they take her weapons away, you're probably out of luck. But as far as that, there you guys go. So anyways, that's going to be it for this video. Be sure to give it a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Comment down below. Tell me what you guys think in the comment section. With that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.